blood to go into the eye. It's not a bad cut, to be honest. Um, it shouldn't stop the fight, and I think the referee is going to give him a chance to put some Vaseline on, which I think is very fair. It's good referee in there from Maladen. Because there's nothing worse than going into a fight, winning the fight, you get a cut, and then the referee stops it, and you're absolutely perfectly in good physical condition. And you want to continue mentally and physically your fight, and just the cut stops it. There's nothing worse. A cut should not stop a fight unless it's actually going bleeding into the eye. Or causing, oh, is that you know, wide open, obviously, oh, that's, uh, that's going to lose a lot of blood. So back in the action here. Only a minute gone, and we've seen Stop. some terrific Stop. action from both no, fighters. Both oh, happy to trade. There's some big punch, like I said. Stop. Stop. Miriam Fabian needs to keep his hands up because Stefan is dangerous with his hands. Good with his low kicks, too. Not discounting the fact that he can use his legs. Both of them are trading off with the low kicks. But their hands seem to be just that Stop. little bit more Stop. effective no, coming Stop. from Stefan. Just, I feel he's a little bit more accurate. It's the slip there. Wants to knock down. Again, good referee in. Stop, stop, stop. Stop. Time. Again, time held. Blood must be going into his, around his eye. Can't just see it from this angle where we have, but on from the camera. But uh, the referee's done that for a reason. Closing stages of this second round. And they're trying to staunch that, but they need to be doing that between the round. The doctors here are going to put some adrenaline on that. Personally, I should have just put some Vaseline on, sent him back out, and then done this in between rounds. Saying that, both fighters are taking a rest, so, you know, equal share of the reprieve. And a well earned little rest. No, quick fix, back Down. in the action. Ooh, again, solid shots. Coming from the man who's caught. And knowing he's caught with the fighting with Fury. Lands big punches right here above the commentary station. Best seat in the house. Sat here with Peter Linker, our ring announcer of all the FSC shows. Oh, sat here privileged to watch this action Stop. unfold. Stop! Yeah, after so no kick. Hey. The referee a warning there. Obviously about clinching, you can only use one clinch knee and let go. You cannot clinch and continue holding or holding and kneeing. It's one knee and let go. Box two uppercut there Stop. coming from Stefan. Big right arm. I tell you what, Miriam Fabian's got a chin on him. That's for sure. Took some big shots and looks like he hasn't even been bothered. And coming out to the Rocky theme. Who's that? He is of the Rocky ilk. There's the 10 seconds warning. And there we have it. Well, if I was in the red corner, I'd be saying two things. Number one, keep your hands higher. But number two, kick. I've seen this guy warming up. I've seen him fight on many occasions. He's fought on the FSC shows before. And Mirian Fabian can't half kick. He just doesn't seem to put it into action. He's happy to have a whack off, as we say in England, which means a trade off of punching. And I really do believe he should use his legs because I've seen, like I said, his kicking action. His hands aren't too bad, don't get me wrong. Mary and Fabian's hands are good. But I do feel that Stefan Zukovic, the Serbian, is playing the game. And he's using his hands to the max. He might be the man who's cut, but a, a cut man is a dangerous man. I've seen that happen so many times in the fight, fight game. You don't sense, do the, the opponent's blood, they smell their own, taste their own, and it fires them up. Is this last one? So it can work for and against you. Judge! Judge, judge, timekeeper, fight! Here we go, third and final round, three three minute rounds. Again, happens to 
trade off with the punches. And we talk about the Rocky tune that he came out to. Sweat and water flies off his head, Rocky style. He should play the Rocky tune while the fight's on. <laughs> Strict warning there from Milado Crunchex. That's what all refereeing's about, being fair, making sure both fighters are treated the same. And that's what this referee's doing right now. Making sure they fight clean. I mean, at this level, both these guys don't need dirty tactics in them. Not deliberate either. I've got to say, I've seen Marine fight many times. He's not a dirty fighter. He puts his heart and soul into the fight game. And he just has to do what he has to do to win. It'll be interesting to see how the judges have got this because actually I've not done what I've done with previous fights and I normally do an unofficial scorecard. At the moment, um, it's a tricky one because it's quite close. And it's the saying I've used on many a fight. Who wants it the most? Stop. Who's the hungriest? Fight. That decides who will win. The Stop. heart, the say of a lion, but it's not a lion Fight. in there right now. These are men, mere mortals with Stop. exceptional skills though. And they need to impress on each other who Fight. will be the dominant male, the alpha male in the ring. Well, one minute remaining in this round. Both fighters giving their all, both feeling the fatigue. Eight minutes of, of the nine minutes fighting. 45 seconds remaining. Stop! Who wants it the most? Over half a minute left now in this last round. Both fighters feeling the pace from solid, solid action. It's been a tough fight for these two guys, both taking and soaking up some punishment, but giving out punishment equally. It's going to be interesting to see who will win this match. It's a tough one for the judges. Big right hand there, right near the belt. And there we have it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you know what? There should be two winners. I will give that a draw. Crowd appreciating that, just look round. Everyone's hands are together, clapping with this. Absolutely fantastic fight. Just got to be left now down to the judges. Who will they choose? Here we see some of the slow-mo action. I always love watching slow motion. Look at that, Rocky style. Sweat flies from the top of the head. Wham, bam, and thank you, ma'am. We see the action there unfold from these two modern-day gladiators. Stefan Zukovic from Serbia and Mirjan Fabian from Slovenia. The judges have go. made their decision. It's a tough call. It is a split decision. Wow, said it was close. In favour of the fighter in the blue corner fighting out of Serbia, Stelan Zhukovic. Well, a split decision. I said it was close. I would have given it a drop. Fabian doesn't look impressed. He felt he'd done enough. He looks at the judges. He looks around the auditorium, the Zagreb Arena. A Stephen, little bit dismayed. You came as a late replacement uh, uh, the for, for Evan the Zora, and you pull up an upset in a great performance. Uh, maybe it was upset on the paper, but I know I'm a twice better fighter than Fabian. And if I 
were uh, better prepared, I will uh, put the uh, best my performance. Also, you fight uh, at uh, less weight and a lower division than this. Uh, this is an 80 kilo fight, so you were, you were a smaller fighter. Yes, but I am a bigger puncher. Thank you very much, uh, Stevan. It was a pleasure. I want to thank uh, Croatian public for supporting me and for uh, feel like home. And also my fans, uh, friends and friends back in Serbia. Thank you very much. And I hope I di didn't disappoint you and, I will, uh, and uh, to fight the next event. Thank you again. Thank you, Stevan. You were great. Final Fight Championship vraća se u Zagrebačku arenu s najjačom priredbom godine. U sudaru udarača i greplara sastoju se Zelk Galešić i bivši UFC-ov prvak Rico Rodriguez. Ante Delia suočit će se s nizozemcem Dionom Staringom, dok će nasuprot mladenu Brestovcu stajati Ali Tornado Čenik. Petak, 25. listopada, arena Zagreb, Final Fight Championship 8. Ulaznice u sustavu eventima.